Hi, St. Paul's sewers, sewers with an E, not sewers with an O. I'm excited about a project that uh, Louise Cannon sort of came up with going through some of her mother's sewing items. Anyone who wants to, all volunteers are welcome, can make one of these. Four squares with the stars. We'll put them all together after everybody is finished and we will make beautiful wall hangings that we can put in the undercroft or even up in the sanctuary. Louise has carefully made little packets for sewers and they are labeled. So I'll show you what's in this packet. This one she says has one finished star already and then the materials to make the rest of the stars. So here's the finished star. And then here are the triangles needed to make the other three stars and the background fabric for behind each star and the little borders that go between each square. So again, it will come out looking like this with four finished stars sewn onto background squares with fabric in between as a border. It looks like she hand stitched the stars on because there's nothing seen on the other side. It's beautiful. And then she must have used a machine to attach the squares together. Louise Cannon would be the person to talk to about any questions, but I have all of these sets. So if you're interested in picking up a set, let me know. We'll have them at uh, the Shrove Tuesday, Ash Wednesday pickups. They'll also be available Sundays in the parking lot if you come for a communion, a drive-through communion, or I can deliver them to your house. I'm excited about this chance for our community to do something together and create something gorgeous that we'll look at for years. Thank you so much.